Hello everybody, what is up Proctos here? As you can see, we're actually here finally with some Persona 5. Now, originally I was wanting, this was supposed to go out last week, but for whatever reason, I think it's maybe because I had the headphone jack plugged into the controller, I don't know, but the audio did not record for this gameplay. Everything else, like the video of me, the audio, the my voice recording worked, but for some reason this didn't want to work, so I was like, oh, okay, well shit, this will have to wait till next week. So. Before further ado, let's actually start our game now. Now, so far this has actually been a... Yeah, okay, but now I'm just saying like, Hey, you got downloadable content! Which is basically, when the game launched, they kind of say, Hey, here's some free DLC for some um, cards in the game, and also some free items, which is kind of cool. Similarities between characters. As far as kind of where he's like, the story is fiction. Only those you must sign the contract by agreeing. I'm like, okay, alright, this contract has been sealed. The world is not as it I remember the good old days when you signed a Persona game and you had to sign a contract by putting your name in there. But you know what? This will do too. But you still get to choose your names later on anyway, so... From time to time, they were re you are the trickster. And funny, yeah, I've seen some funny parts where they put your first name and last name is my name, so it's like, my name is my name. Which really freaking, probably in the storyline, I'll make it really easy. Like, Yo, my name, what's up? But yeah, this goes so far, I've been enjoying the crap out of the story. It's kind of cool because they, from what I heard, they kind of pulled stuff out of uh, earlier personas, like, Instead of you just getting a persona in a card after you finish a battle, you actually happen to, you know, actually have to convince when you get them to like a last inch of your life and you're about to all, what is it, basically the all out technique where you basically just everybody goes in at them. You can sit there and go like, hey, either give me money, give me an item, or join me. Which sometimes, it, like, the join me is also kind of cool because it's like, they don't just say, oh sure, why not? You actually have to talk to them and kind of hope you choose the right dialogue in order for them to actually, you know, want to join you. So, definitely pretty interesting aspect. Now we get a first glimpse at our hero, Joker, or should I say our Phantom Thief Joker. Being all sly as fuck. But this right, bitches? I just fucking robbed you. What you gonna do about it? I'll tell you, it's a whole lot of nothing. What's up? Oh shit, they found me. Probably shouldn't have stood wide out in the open, but at this point he's probably like, <laughs> the fuck ever. They ain't gonna catch me. Later, bitches. There's another interesting aspect about this game, instead of, what was it, just freaking like running through shit, you actually have like acrobatics where you can climb shit, find alternate routes to avoid actually having to fight a shit ton of enemies, which is also very freaking useful. These are all the characters that you pretty much don't know yet, but yeah. Which I'm not going to spoil anything because we just started the game, but you'll, you'll see, you'll see. Oh shit, they fucking caught me. I think it doesn't matter. I can easily escape this shit. They ain't nothing. Look at me, agile like a fucking cat. Now this thing I'm kind of wondering about because... They just like instantly morph, so I was like, wait. Am I in the... I can't tell this part because I know this takes place in the future. Sure, this will probably be explained later on in the game, but then it's kind of like, okay, so the guards apparently just turned into that. They did mention later on that you're one for manslaughter, which is really fucking weird. So I'm curious what's going to go on with that, and what the fuck is he? Legs for hands, or well, hands for legs, hands for hands, and whatever that fucking robot explodes to. Oh, there's so of course, we don't know who this is yet. No motherfucker, how dare you? Look, another cool part of the love is the fucking gun. I mean, the guns in this game. And that's how we do it, folks. 
so curious when the hacker girl is going to come and like, ah, oh, she's so freaking cute. Oh my god. Hell yeah, I'm a fucking joker, bitches. Ah, shit. I'm curious how, like, this area differentiates from the real world. Ah, real world. Or this is kind of switching between distortion and real, so it's like, hmm. I don't know. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. I kind of don't feel like being. And this is another part I really was like. Hey, what is up with this casino? Well, I don't know, this could just be part of the distortion world, judging by the whole haze against me, but. I see all this. Success! Enemy, enemy! I don't. Yeah, so I'm like, is this part of the distortion world? It seems like it might be just because of the fact that it's like. Okay, it seems really weird that this high end casino, they have this whole security area in the background, and all of a sudden, this. People are apparently sneaking in, tagging the area, sticking their stuff around. But I didn't see regular people like this, so... I already know this is definitely going to be explained later on. But for now, we'll just we'll just enjoy the story. Huh? What? Oh shit. You can't get caught here. It's okay, I'll use my super stealth sneaking techniques. I will continue the search. Huh. You ain't fucking see me, bitch. Later. I see that if, you'll probably see the gameplay recording paused, mainly because of the fact that I was originally wanting to do this along with a regular series, and also kind of go between doing a little bit of streams to kind of progress the story along. But you know. Atlas doesn't want people to leak the story even though people have already been uploading shit to the gameplay. But basically they made it so you cannot live stream this because it will block the gameplay. So I'm like, damn it, why? This has been such a good game to freaking live stream at times. After that commotion, the bottom floor is completely closed off. Hey, can you make it? Yeah, come on. I'm a fucking joker. Of course I can make it. But seriously, what is up with their freaking walls in there? Like, ha! Really, no way to run? I didn't believe you for a second. See ya. Hey, majestic as fuck! You're so reckless, you know that? Am I awesome? Fuck yeah! Perfect fucking landing. Look at that. What freaking style. Not a single cut on him. Like, ah, uh, fucking hell. We're caught. But yeah, whatever. Thousand armed guards? Ain't no problem for the Joker. Look at me agilely climb this ladder. But yep, yep, and then at that moment, he knew he was fucked. Took his bitch! Now I kinda got a glimpse of what I played so far as the why. He's probably wanted by the police, but not a hundred percent sure. So we're gonna have to go through this together, and maybe possibly figure out why. Alright, I'm gonna have to put this on with some subtitles later. I'm also really curious because I know. There's your basic teammates, and there's also some other people that are supposedly on your team. And as you can see, the drug, the cops are completely fucking drugging me. I don't know why. Guess the drug was Part of thinking is like, yeah, yeah. Watch you all right now, they think I'm a completely dangerous criminal. They don't know what the fuck I can do. If I could just snap her neck with my mind or something, but... Like, guys, it doesn't fucking work that way. No dozing off. Okay. I said, no dozing off. You guys fucking pump me full of drugs. Like, why are you falling asleep? What the hell's wrong with you, man? Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? No, sir. I would not like another shot. He's uh, no feel good. Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Come on. We're the freaking FBI. You think you're really gonna release that? 
Which is good. Because we get to take as much time as we need. Ah, shit. Maybe I should have said yes. Maybe it would have took longer. Destruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Yeah, so that's what I was talking about. I was like, how was I going to do manslaughter? I mean, those guards I attacked, they're monsters, right? They're the freaking shadows? Oh, no. See, that's probably confused me. Hmm. What the fuck did this guy do? I was enjoying it? Everything says I can't remember. You should know your place. Okay. I have a feeling if I had help, you guys are gonna show me. Oh good, they're uncuffing me. Sign here. It's a confession. Confession for what? I ain't confessing shit, you don't even know what the fuck I did, man. I need your hand to sign this, but I don't care if you end up losing a leg. God damn, these guys are freaking savage. Like yeah, we need to sign it's like, you know, I'll fucking cut off a leg if you want. It don't matter. We'll get the fucking signature. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are what the fuck am I signing this for then? Like, so what? You guys gonna fucking break some limbs? Fuck me up a bit? And I'm like, alright, you can go now. That seems punishment enough. Alright, so I think we'll do our uh, standard prof toast that we usually do when I play throughs. Enter, nope, wait. Oh yeah, confirm. Oops, hold on, hold on. There we go, prof. Confirm. Toast. Prof Toast, that is my name. I'm finished! Hayes, Hayes, who I'm assuming but this area is, off. is more than likely my lawyer. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's we don't give office. a damn. What business do you have here? Well, usually when you're from a prosecutor office, uh, generally that means I'm here to represent the client. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Bullshit! I'm the one who freaking tried to uncover this. Besides. You prosecutor sign these, Yuma? Yeah. There's a call from your director. Hurry and what? get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. Whoa. How did you know I was gonna get a phone call? I don't know, I think he's the one real one with all these weird abilities that's been killing people. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation. Yeah, that's kinda true. That was kinda weird. Hell yeah. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Yeah, don't get in my fucking way. Uh, good luck to you then. Ah, oh, okay, don't cool. Expecting much, though. Well, it's a good thing that my director believes in me so much. It's really what gives me confidence uh, every day to go along my job. Something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. The hell? <sighs> it's for your own sake. Really? His methods are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. Says the guy who was having his men drug him and kick the shit out of him and dump water on him. They go, here, sign this. I understand. So you want to tell me what the fuck's going on, man? There's some real shit. You'll be answering my questions this time. Okay. Those bastards. Yeah, it's some pretty heavy shit. It seems almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. 
That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? It was for the good of humanity, I swear. I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Of course you couldn't. <laughs> You're like, yeah. Yeah, what the fuck you want, man? Couldn't figure out my method. Fucking Thanos, thief. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you yeah. find out about here, that world? Yeah, about 50 50, really. How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Well, now, first you gotta. Your account of wine. First you gotta take him out for dinner. Show him a little romantic scenery. Maybe a nice sunset. Start from the very beginning. Okay, man. Oh shit. Whoa, these drugs are really kicking in, man. Look at that fucking butterfly. Holy shit. You are held captive. A prisoner yeah. to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing we stole quite a few hearts. For very, very good reasons, I mind you. It all began that day, when the game was started half a year ago. For the sake of your world's future, as well as your own, you must remember. Okay, magical butterfly, I'll do what you say, but I won't like it. Use I will save. As you can see, there's my last freaking hour 40 worth of recording. That basically was like, oh, right, let's start getting this shit edited. That video that you guys probably saw last Monday where I was doing a little persona skit. Uh, basically, 